Okay, you've had this relationship for seven years. Yes. Okay, you have a child together. And I'm curious why in the world you are allowing this man or any man or any woman, anybody to dictate your life to you. Why, why are you know. doing that? I don't know. No, that's not, a, that's, that's not an answer. What do you mean you don't know? You, you've had seven years to think about this before you walked out here and sat down with me. I guess I, in a way, I feel like I need it. I don't know how, I don't know how to do it on my own. You don't know how to do what? Be who I am. I don't know who I am anymore. It's been so long that I don't know who I am. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I could do it without Lawrence. It terrifies me, the fact that if I left him, I would be on my own. The fact that you think you can't do it without Lawrence terrifies me. That terrifies me because that tells me that your self-esteem, your self-worth, your self-confidence has been eroded to the point that you have no confidence in your ability to function in this world without somebody else helping you. Mm -hmm. I want to be with him. I love him. He is a good man. He's a good father. There are good things about Thank him. You. When it's good, it's good. But when it's bad, it's really bad. You know, the number one tool of an abuser is isolation. Because if they cut their victim off from the world, from friends and family and clergy and you know, just, just others, then they have the ability to start influencing and controlling. But if that person goes out and has lunch with a friend who says, well, my husband doesn't do that, and, and that's not healthy, that's not right, that could cause you to question it, and that disrupts the control of a controller when they get input from the outside. You're isolated. I, I, I mean, I, I went down and made a list. Uh, no car, that's isolation. Approving purchases, that's controlling you with money, that's isolation. No family contact, isolation. No contact with this friend, isolation. You can't tell anybody that you're pregnant. That's isolation. Yes, it was one is. person, it was her mother. So how's this working for you as far as your peace of mind, your happiness? your self-worth and esteem. How's this working for you? Not very well.